Have you ever wondered what it would be like to travel through time? This question sparks our curiosity, doesn't it? Time travel, the idea of hopping from one era to another, has been a recurring theme that has captivated human imagination for centuries. Our fascination is reflected in countless stories, movies, and theories that explore this intriguing concept. Now picture this, you're about to step into a time machine ready to journey into the vast unknown. Imagine stepping into a time machine and venturing into the unknown, what would happen? Meet John, a hypothetical character who has discovered the secret to time travel. John, driven by an insatiable curiosity, harnesses a momentous leap in technology, and ventures back to a period where no human has ever set foot, the age of dinosaurs. As the thunderous footsteps of these ancient giants echo around him, he's suddenly a stranger in a strange land, a world untouched by the hand of man. One of the very first challenges he faces is communication. Sure, he has books, maps, knowledge of the stars, but how does one communicate with beings that have never seen or heard a human before? The chirps and roars of the dinosaur age are a far cry from the languages we know today. And it's not just about the dinosaurs. The insects, the plants, even the weather, everything is alien to him. Then there's the matter of survival. The dinosaur age is not a welcoming place for a modern-day human. Predators lurk around every corner and even the plant life can be perilous. And let's not forget about viruses and bacteria. With an immune system unaccustomed to prehistoric pathogens, even a minor infection could prove fatal. But perhaps the most daunting challenge John faces is the risk of altering history. The butterfly effect as they call it. A single misplaced step could crush an insect that was meant to be a dinosaur's dinner. That dinosaur could then starve altering the entire food chain and, subsequently, the course of evolution. John's journey is fraught with peril and yet, he continues. He continues because he is curious, because he is brave, and because he wants to understand the world beyond his own time, but his journey is more than just an adventure. It's a cautionary tale, a reminder that even the smallest actions can have profound impacts, and that the past, present and future are intricately linked. John's journey offers a fascinating glimpse into the potential realities of time travel. But how would time travel even work, scientifically speaking? Well, let's dive into the mind-boggling world of theoretical physics to answer that. First off, we have Einstein's theory of relativity. According to this theory, time isn't the same for everyone. Imagine you're aboard a spaceship zooming close to the speed of light. To you, time would seem to pass normally but to someone observing from Earth, you would appear to be moving in slow motion. This is known as time dilation. So, in a sense, if you could travel close to the speed of light, you could theoretically travel into the future. Now, let's shift gears a little and look at wormholes. These are theoretical passages through space-time, kind of like a cosmic shortcut. If wormholes exist and we could somehow keep them stable, they could potentially provide a quick route to a different time or place. However, we should mention that wormholes are purely theoretical at this point and even if they do exist, keeping them stable enough for travel is currently beyond our technological capabilities. Finally, let's delve into the concept of time dilation a bit more. It's not just speed that can affect the passage of time but gravity as well. The stronger the gravitational field, the slower time passes. This is why time on Earth's surface moves a fraction slower than time in orbit. Now you might be thinking, great. I'll just find a strong gravitational field or a spaceship that can travel close to the speed of light. But hold your horses. These methods of time travel aren't without their potential dangers. Traveling at near light speeds or near strong gravitational fields would require immense energy, and even a slight miscalculation could have catastrophic consequences. Furthermore, even if we could manage to travel through time, we would still have to contend with the complexities and paradoxes that come with it. What happens if you alter the past? Could you accidentally erase your own existence? While these theories are fascinating, they also highlight the potential dangers and complexities of time travel. Scene script. Time travel isn't just about hopping into a machine and zooming off to another era, it's fraught with paradoxes and problems. One of the most famous paradoxes is the grandfather paradox. Imagine you invent a time machine and travel back to when your grandfather was a boy. In a dark twist, let's say, you accidentally cause a mishap that leads to his untimely demise. This raises a logical conundrum. If your grandfather died before he had children, how could your parent, and by extension you, come to exist? If you were never born, then how could you have traveled back in time to cause your grandfather's death? It's a dizzying cycle, isn't it? 
Then there's the bootstrap paradox named after the phrase, pulling yourself up by your bootstraps. This paradox deals with objects or information that exist without any discernible point of creation. Imagine you're a scientist who receives a detailed blueprint of a time machine from your future self. You use this blueprint to build the time machine and eventually you travel back in time and give the blueprint to your younger self. So who actually created the blueprint? It seems to exist in a loop, with no clear origin. These paradoxes present logical problems for the concept of time travel. They challenge our understanding of cause and effect, suggesting that actions in the future can influence events in the past. This idea contradicts our everyday experience, where causes always precede their effects. However, some physicists speculate that these paradoxes wouldn't actually pose a problem. They propose the concept of multiple or parallel universes, where each decision creates a new, separate universe. So, if you were to travel back in time and change something, you'd simply create a new timeline, a new universe, while the original timeline remains unchanged. But this is just speculation. The truth is we don't fully understand the nature of time and how it might behave under extreme conditions like time travel. These paradoxes add to the complexity and intrigue of time travel. Beyond the scientific and logical problems, time travel also raises ethical questions. Imagine for a moment that you had the power to journey through time. That power in the wrong hands could be devastating. This is where the moral and ethical implications of time travel come into play. Firstly, let's consider the potential to alter history. If one could travel back in time, they could potentially change the course of events. But would it be right to do so? Even if the intentions were noble, like preventing a tragic event, the ripple effects could be unpredictable. A small change in the past could dramatically reshape the present, potentially erasing entire cultures, civilizations, or even species. Then, there's the risk of causing harm to others. What if your actions in the past inadvertently caused someone's demise? Or what if your presence in a different time period introduced a disease that the people of that time had no immunity to? The potential for unintentional harm is immense. Next, we have the responsibility of knowledge about the future. If you knew what was going to happen, would you have an obligation to try to change it? And if you did change it, would that be playing God? Deciding the fate of others based on what you know about the future could be seen as an abuse of power. Moreover, the ability to time travel could lead to exploitation. Imagine the wealthy using time travel to further enrich themselves, creating an even wider gap between the haves and the have-nots, or governments using it as a tool for surveillance or control. These ethical dilemmas underscore the magnitude of responsibility that would come with the ability to time travel. Time travel, a captivating concept, a complex enigma, and a potential ethical minefield. As we've journeyed through the labyrinth of time in this discussion, we've seen how the science suggests that time travel could be more than just a figment of our imagination. We've delved into the paradoxes that time travel presents, the conundrums that can make your head spin faster than a time vortex. We've also pondered the ethical implications, the weighty responsibility that comes with the power to change the past or shape the future. We've heard about the story of John, a hypothetical time traveler and the dilemmas he might face. Time travel is not just a simple leap from one moment to another. It's a dance with causality, a tangle with the very fabric of reality. So if you ever find yourself with a time machine, remember, time travel is more than just an adventure. It's a responsibility. And always, it remains an intriguing mystery.